is Carter Sports back. And today we head down to Texas to check out a running back who just committed to SC. So let's go. And if you've been here before, can you please hit that like, please? And if you ain't subscribed, boy, you better subscribe. Disclaimer under section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. Entering into the chat, we got Riley Wormley, a 5'9", 170 pound running back out of South Lake, Texas, playing for South Lake Carroll, you hear me? Class of 2025, three star, but don't pay attention to that three star. This kid been off by Oklahoma, Texas, Oregon, all the big boys. He's a big boy that he committed to yours truly, USC Trojans. You might think he a little undersized at 5'9", 170. He, that's probably one of the reasons he rated a three star in the uh, 11 second plus 100 meter. Probably right where he rated a three star. But if you watch this kid film and break it down, this kid got plenty enough ability to break runs back there. Because you know what he got? He got vision. He got patience. He know how to set up his blocks. He know how to set up them angles. You take the wrong angle and he going to break you down. He going to shift on you. He's a shifty running back who know how to play angle and cut back play to his strength. Once you make a mistake on your pursuit angle, he shifting it back. He kind of remind me of a Blake Corum type running back. You know what I'm saying? Very shifty, very vision awareness to his game. He see the gap. He see the play before it happened. He's a step above the play. See, sometimes when you ain't got 4-3 speed, you develop the innate ability to anticipate ahead. So if your mind is faster, it can make up for a lack of speed. But this kid got plenty of quickness, plenty of short area burst quickness to get through the hole. Self-reporter, he run a 40 or 4, 4 5. So the kid don't look slow to me track time and football speed is the different thing you know what i'm saying some players run faster on the football field some players run faster on track it's different when you getting chased than to when you chasing the finish line out there you know what i'm saying so on that football field he got plenty enough quickness and plenty of enough ability because his cerebral game he is cerebral running back like i said my comp is blake corn and usc the stacking up racking up i told y'all about a month ago when we only had one commit I told y'all about a month ago, maybe two months ago, we only had one commit. That SC is going to have a top five recruiting class. You hear me? And that was before the NIL even kicked in. You heard me? We going for the number one ranked recruiting class. Y'all best believe it. They shook. They scared. Man, y'all know what time it is. Anthony Jones first commit, first offer. If he Anthony Jones first off, he that kid got an eye for talent being down there at TCU. He got an eye for talent. He got an eye for that talent that some people be overlooking. You hear me? So his pedigree, Anthony Jones, I trust his judgment. So welcome on down. Wildly Wormly, you hear me? I apologize for the hiatus. I've been on the road. I've been traveling, but I'm back and I'm finna load them back up and back up and back up. You hear me? <laughs> Riley Rowley, welcome to the family. You know what I'm saying? Trojan City, SC. We gonna fight on forever with this one and we rocking and rolling. We rocking and rolling. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Expect before the summer out. Expect before the season. By the time the season start, we gonna have about like 15 commits. 15, 16 commits. Believe that. <laughs> 
believe that every visit that we got coming up, somebody is going to commit. And we got about like five or six more visit dates, about like 20, 25 more athletes coming in. You hear me? So USC got them scared. We got them scared out there. We got them shook. <laughs> they shook. Y'all seen on three lately? On three is begging Julian Lewis to decommit from USC. They're literally begging running shows every day talking about they want him to decommit justice terry they are begging these kids to decommit on three y'all should be ashamed of yourself man <laughs> trojan fans i know y'all be saying that i see y'all in the comments on three is awesome but ain't nothing gonna stop this because they scared they shook they hoping it ain't true they hope usc go three and nine next season or something they hoping and praying because they know this thing has got rolling the only thing can stop it or slow it down a little bit is a media propaganda machine hating on the product you hear me but until then it's quarter sports it's usc it's trojan city so let's go